Hey everybody, how you doing? Lazarus here once again with another episode of Let's Play Lama Lama 2 Blind Hard Mode. So, uh, long time no see, I suppose, I mean, not super long, but it's been, it's been like a week, I guess, since I've actually gotten anything recorded, and there was a reason for that stream slash recorded. Um, I came to a realization that using, oh, you fuck, try to talk. Bullshit arrow nonsense. Trying to do an intro here. Okay. So, <coughs> to explain my absence, um, came to a realization about using NVIDIA Shadowplay for streaming to Twitch. It, uh, will show you a subscription, like a viewer count, but, uh, the chat box, the chat box, which I've never seen work, is because it only works for streaming to Facebook. So, I did actually receive my first Twitch comment, and I didn't even fucking know. So that sucks. But, uh, Lost Crack, uh, thank you. I think you count as my first official fan, which is pretty damn awesome. So I do feel kind of shitty that I missed my first official comment from you. But, uh, shout out to Lost Crack. You're a damn cool guy. You followed, you followed me when I was playing Ascension Technomancer back during Season 1, and you're just right back on board when I come back after way too long of an absence, so um, shout out to you, you're an awesome dude. But um, yeah, so what did we do about this, um, this shadow play conundrum here? I've always liked shadow play because it was super lightweight and it just worked. But um, yeah, those days are over, we gotta use, um, we're using OBS, specifically we're using a open broadcast software, we're using the Streamlabs OBS, otherwise known as SLOBS, not really a great acronym for your software. I have my laptop over here, so I can see what's going on in the stream. I can see any comments that are going by over there. It's not somewhat real time. I don't want to, like, it's fine for Lama Lana, but I don't want to be uh, play, trying to play Minecraft and also having the video of the stream open at the same time. It's a very ta it's very taxing having that pack running. So, and it really does not like having um, a browser open, or maybe I'm presuming any sort of video player might piss it off, so hence the laptop, we'll use that for watching the stream. I could, I didn't realize I couldn't see any of the elements, like there's a whole like theme, you can actually see my picture, my, my face cam, it's got the little glowy ball over it, and a little border, all sorts of fancy stuff, I don't know, they, there's themes, there's like a whole overlay system for Twitch, and I picked one that, I don't know, it's kind of nice, it's got nice alerts, it's got intermission and starting stream, stopping stream things, so glowy border for the chat box, which I turned off, because if there's not actually comments streaming by, then it's just a glowy box in the corner of the stream for nothing. Not, not particularly, it doesn't really um, add to the viewing experience, so we'll turn that on as needed. So anyhow, enough rambling about just, you know, goings on and doings and things of a technical nature. What are we doing here in-game today? Well, let's uh, figure out where the fuck we were and what we were doing last time. Uh, last time was quite productive. We got Earth Spears, so we can now hit any of those little switches embedded in the ground. And we've hit a few of them. We also got this thing. The Gale Fibula. Um, it breast-mounted accessory. <laughs> She's got her first breast-mounted accessory. She's becoming a woman. Yeah, that was... Uh, oh, I got the one which well. I'm sorry. But, uh, yeah, we are going to dash like the wind. Uh, can dash like the wind. It's not exactly true. It's where the wearer is obligated to dash like the wind ubiquitously. Like, you got it on, you're standing still, you're fine. The second you touch the fucking the D pad, I'm playing with D pad, you can use thumbstick if you want. It's 2D game, you can use D pad. But uh, yeah, you'll just start booking it. You'll be dashing, and like, you can't stop. You'll hit a wall, and that will stop you, like, bounce off the wall, and then you'll be stopped for a minute. But you can't control it. Like, you will just be running. You'll be dashing as long as it's equipped. At which point I found out you can actually unequip things. As a matter of fact, it actually says equip item here. I don't think that was even a concept in the first game. They're like, why would you ever want to remove the gloves? So, like, what, I couldn't push blocks. Why would you remove the grapple claw? Uh, very rarely does it ever annoy you. Remove the scale spear? Like, why would you do that? That's just stupid. It just happened all the time. But this thing, you need to be able to turn it off. So we turned it off. But now, there I remember there being two places in here with shit that would crush you, that we can now... Oh, these guys, fucking Locopala, is that what they're called? Locopalas. 
Yeah, I hate that. Hey, what we found? Uh, this. Let's hit it. Boom. Nice. That is um something. We need more Earth spheres. Like I feel like there's sure this place. I'm sure it's. I feel like we have seen a shop somewhere for Earth spheres, like. But we got two left, and they're pretty important. There's a lot of those switches, dude. We need more. I've wasted a couple by accident. It sucks. But, you know, we need more. Alright. This is a hot spring where you can relax and regain your strength. You can pay a 30G donation to enter. Um, yeah, nah, I don't, I don't need that right now, dude. We got, we got full HP. <laughs> there seem to be more of those, like, in this game. Like, there are, like, secondary locations to get your HP back. And that's fine. They're not free, obviously. Uh, I think I want to go... Yeah, I still haven't decided how I feel about the rate meter. I, I'm still pretty sure it sucks. Is it, is it faster or slower than the web? And they seem about the same speed. I want the axe. I really just, I just want the axe, dude. That I'll be, I'll be much happier when I have the axe. But that's a thud. We don't know how to open this yet, do we? Is that Spears? Did I just get Spears? Oh, sweet! That was Spears. Nice. Now we have 12. No longer uh, such a concern. We're running out of Spears. Because we were running out of Spears. That was going to suck. Now, the zone is um, it's very big, and I do not remember where the, the things were. The things that um, you, need to, you need to dash for, so we're going to just have to roam around a bit. i got to handle this crack in here. Yeah, we got a Kraken on the loose. The Kraken apparently had some mad bank on it. I mean, I guess they do. I mean, you don't know. I, I never th I never thought of squids as having, you know, carrying a lot of cash on them, but maybe they do. We've been here, right? We've done this. This was nothing. Yeah, this is... Uh, oh, yeah, we need to get a sigil here. We need this sigil. Without it, we are not doing whatever's in here. So this mini boss this is a total ripoff. We killed this dude. That was where Meta Knight was. Or Meta Knight, you know, Meta Knight lookalike. Meta Knight analog. And yeah, it was worthless. Now we get this dude here. He's gonna like, kinda hemming me in here. I'm not thrilled with that. And this shit, get out of the way of that real quick before that happens. Got another Kraken. We'll get rid of the Kraken here. Uh, yep, he's. He just takes a bunch of hits, man. Sometimes you can, like, stun lock, and other times you can't. You just kind of, like, it keeps advancing anyway. I'd love to hit that thing, but just just for the record, you can't. I've tried. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we can. You can't. Not. What would you do? Maybe you'd have to, like, drain the water out of here? I guess you'd have to drain the water out of here in order to hit that. I was to say. There are two sigils hidden with drink dragons. Check the back of the three-eyed dragons. Okay. Back of the three-eyed dragons. That part I don't really get. But I mean, yeah, dragon sigils. Like, so, you know, I mean, obviously, if you find a dragon, you know, it's, it's scary. Dragon, Dragons is scary. Dragons, dragons definitely kind of scare me, but, you know, you know, you, know, you gotta do something about it. You can't just, you can't just let the dragon live. We've never been to this room. We've never been, this is Jormungandr's room. I presume that the Ankh will show up in here, and that, that, um, Stone tablet looks a little different than usual. I've got this fucker here. What is this? Oh, hey, it's part one of Althir Cirrus's prophecy. Well, let's read. Sound fills the air. Imdal blows his horn. Imdal is the guy that was in that the room of Bifrost when we first like this you know, the hole we dropped into World Battlefield the first time. There's that just that dude sitting on the edge of the hole just chilling and something about him. He's just gonna sit there and wait till like, the end of times. So that's him. That's Imdal. Oh, he's got a horn. Yggdrasil shakes. A screech winds out from the towering ancient tree. The Jotun are unleashed. Imdal does not sleep. He keeps a vigilant watch even though the night... even as the night... even through the night as the end approaches. This, um... I, the, the lore around the first game really kind of covered a lot of different world cultures. This seems to be very... Like, the one thing it didn't have was a lot of Norse mythology, and this seems to be, like, really heavily based around Norse mythology, which is neat. I mean, Norse mythology is cool. The Vikings and, like, you know, Skyrim, all that stuff. You know, Skyrim, that that happened in, in Norse mythology. 
you read the book. Whoa, this, this is neat. We, how have we never been to this freaking room before? The spiral boat. So, I mean, we've heard several things about boats. I thought they were talking about the, um, the Fairy King's boat. Mainly because that's like a boat that we found. But, like, this guy, this, this boat right here is something else entirely. I pretty much had that coming. I don't know why. I... Oh, yeah, that shit. That's still being Really? It was just... Really? This was right here. Ooh, it's a scrolly room. I'm not gonna swing at that. That's, um, if you're... I've, I've mentioned that in earlier episodes. We've been told that thing there is a lamp of time refill point, and this is... Dude, there's several eye... There's more than one eyeball in here. Is one eyeball not enough? Oh, yeah, also, we can't do anything else. We gotta... Let's, let's go. Oh. Bye-bye. Huh. How have we never been over here? Like, that's... Just crazy. That's... Oh, squid, squid. Got more squids. Squids. So many squids. We just killed these squids. Why are you back already? Also, it's kind of hypnotic watching him, like, tentacle his way across the ground. Oh, fucking squid. Got too goddamn much HP. Like, entirely too much HP. Alright, now we got a de pretty decent stun locking there. Squid drum, some big balls, dude. Big squid balls. He's got some big squid balls. Mm -hmm. Alright, some more squid in here. Of course, it's a skeleton dance. Look at that. Look at that. That's some good stuff right there. Skeleton dance. Let's drink it in. Alright, he's done. Fuck him. We don't have time to just sit here all fucking night and watch skeletons dance. We got shit to do. Alright, I don't know what you're thinking. You're, you're not gonna beat this game with that kind of attitude. Like, just sitting around watching skeletons dance. We've been in here before. I mean, that, that tablet's been red. And you see the tablet, like, that one in Jormungandr's room did look different. Also, I can see the entire screen now with the street, the, the um, uh, slobs. With slobs. We're gonna call it slobs. That's what they want the app to be called. I don't see my face cam anymore. I gotta look over there to see it. Which is, I mean, like, I can't see myself look at it. Unless I, like, I can see how I looked a second ago. Because, you know, it's, 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 it's live, but it's, there's some lag. There's a little latency going on there just for all the electronic magic to be happening out there in the ether that lets me twitch at you. But, uh, yeah, okay, this is Yama, so... He's talking... Did we write this guy's thing down? Across the room of sticks with a small key in hand. Is that the golden key? I feel like this whole, like, underworld thing is very, very similar. It really feels like the Gate of Elu like or the Eden puzzle from Mamalana 1, where you essentially unlocking Gate of Illusion. Alright, well, uh, if we didn't write down what he said, we'll write down what he said. He had a lot to say. We've, we've read it before. It's confusing. I would love... I would just... I would, I would really love to be touching that Grail tablet there. That, which is not gonna happen. I mean, it's just not. Like, we cannot reach it. So, let's get that out of our heads. Oh my god, you fucking... You fucking douchebag. What is this? Bullshit. This is pure bullshit. Alright, can, can I please cross over now? Thanks. Am I allowed to? Can we, like, literally not go this way? Because this fucking douche nozzle over here? Yeah, no. Alright. But we can't... That's right, like... I couldn't actually get off the ladder there. Because this is still drawing on this room. It's got an eyeball, so, like, don't hit that shit over there. I feel like we're close to, um... One of the rooms where we need to dash. Bit of time. I mean, should we see what the skeleton says? I'm kind of afraid that if I jump off this, it's going to be infin infinity drop. Like, there's a room like this in that looks like this, a lot like this in level one of one in Chamber of Birth. And if you jump in the hole, like, or if you don't make your jump, you fall forever. The screen just wraps. I would kind of like to know what Skelly Man down there says, though. Uh... Ooh! Oh, it's the boat! We're in the boat rope! We could 
pop the sigil if we be over there, but look at that, dude. Wait a minute. That's a soul gate. It's got nine things on it. Uh, I kind of expect that there were only going to be eight main bosses. You know, that's the, the, the format of this game, right? My, my knee is itching. It's kind of difficult to itch it. I finished itching it. But so that's, I mean, we just gained some interesting information there. Um, there's at least nine major bosses, not eight. Also, where the hell are we now? Spiral boat. Yeah, that pillar got in the way, so like, how the fuck did we get there? Like, how could we pop that, dude? Because it was a one-way door, like the bottom part that had a one-way door. Huh. But I feel like that's gonna... I mean, I don't hit that, obviously. It seems like, you know, it's death. If you hit that, it's death. You don't hit that wall. I want it. I want to get through there. Like, I don't know how you're supposed to do that, dude. Like, I feel like there's no way in there. Because, like, if that room scrolled over, like, you saw it, there was a one-way door stopping us in the bottom. Those pillars stopped us walking over the top. I mean, like, we have the sigil now. Uh, we're not going to have nine boss souls for quite a while. Where the fuck are we now? Vampire school. Lovely, lovely place. There is unnecessary money, alright? You can know, chuck bombs. You got, got an assault rifle too. I feel like I feel like we're a little undermashed. Also, why don't I get over there? I'd love to be over there and hit that switch. I feel just a little bit um a little bit underprepared gear-wise. With these guys with like, you know, grenades and assault rifles, and I got a whip and a knife, and what the fuck is this? This this looks like trouble. Also, it looks like there's... It's not its not going to be trouble, I don't think. I'm, I'm pretty convinced. Nope! Hey, he's back! Whoa! Squirrel Dude is back! Squirrel Dude is back! We better eat our curry and chill out for a second. Uh, there's no time to take a nap, lady. We gotta, we gotta deal with Squirrely Man. I have no idea what we're going to use on him. Like, how we're going to fight him. I mean, I'm thinking... We can get the drop on him? Probably gonna want to use the whip for increased damage and like the over the head action. This was not even, like we have been in rooms in here that we haven't been in before. In spite of having been to the zone multiple times exploring around, there were two rooms that I was looking for where there would be squishies that would squish us. We don't want to be squished. That we could now get through, and I didn't find either of those. But like this, all of these rooms we've been through. Are entirely new. Also, fucking squirrel face here. We're gonna have to deal with. So let's. I don't want those. Yeah. Okay. That's just, just right in the face with that one. Huh? Wow. Wow. He is fucking me up. All right, we're done with that. So he means business this time around. Also, like that's that's not what we wanted to be doing. But, but like we um. Hold to hunt him down for some reason. Other than the, hunt him down for reasons other than he's still alive. That was the first trial. Also, that's not even remotely what we're looking for. Alright, we're there are there are like two things that we're looking for, and that guy ain't one of them. He's not one of the two things. So alright, let's just um Oh, I should say, I've kind of made a decision that just to, for safety of videos, in case something gets fucked up, I, would, I obviously would do it now. There's three pages of save files, so for each time I break the stream, or each night, we'll say, I have multiple pages, so I should really be using the same save file here, and each time I go to a different stream, or like I break episodes or something, just in case something happens to one episode, I should be saving these files so that I could go back in time. So, like, let's just start doing this correctly now. I had this idea, like, what if a video gets fucked up? What if, like, the audio is, is screwy or, or something bad happens and we lose an episode? You can't replace it unless you have the save file to go back to. We, we have the capacity to, to be safe and do that. I have the capacity, the responsibility 
to be safe and like do that. So I'm gonna do that. Or I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try. I, I can't even say that I'm gonna try. I will try to try, okay? And that's all you're gonna get. But I promise that I'll try to try. Alright, back to the game. Um, so, back to the Immortal Battlefield, and, and when we do still have an Ankh, we have an Ankh up here, but we don't have a jewel. Presumably the jewel's on the back side of Enfun. Enf, en, Enfun. How the fuck do you pronounce that? En, Enfun. This, this is not enough vowels, dude. You need to buy at least one more vowel. Maybe two. Enfun. I was calling Enfun, but the W is before the Fun. And and with an A, actually, we should go back into um, Bulbrook's tent here. Now that we have um, got her free from the last time she fucked things up, she's having some noms. Mm -hmm. some exploring beds. Or anywhere you haven't been yet, or anywhere you want to check, want me to check out. Uh, she can like ninja flip off the walls. Okay, you know you don't. We don't need to go to end with. Just sort of go ahead and take a nap. You are adorable. But, you know, I, I'm pretty sure that um, the story's not going to progress unless we send you off to go get yourself in some trouble that we got to fix. Yeah. She has a feather inside of her head. Feather make double jump. That's, that's, that's my line of thought. Is that feather make double jump. Does she have feather in her head? I would, like, I would like that feather. And possibly some of your fries, if at all possible. Also, I like your stockings. They're, they're pretty neat. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and go up ahead and see what's around me. Go, and go on, down ahead, go down ahead. Okay, fine. But you didn't go down. You definitely went up. You made a point of making a joke about, like, a, well, we're gonna go up ahead. No, I'm actually gonna go down. And then you went up. Whatever, alright? Whatever. Let's just try and find the room without fucking aggro on any more of these douchebags with assault rifles. We are there. We have found the room that we that which we seek. So now we pop this shit on and hope that it works. It did not work. I was misled. Do we actually there was a little bit of lag? Do we need to Do we need to start the dash from the other room? Is that what we did wrong here? Skeleton. Fuck you. This little dude. I mean, they look so happy, but I still hate them. I was definitely misled into believing that... that, 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 uh, thing that we have fucked some Things have come fucked up already. As a matter of fact, I'm just going to go back. We're just going get, to get back to that starting point here. I was misled into believing that the dash is what we would need to deal with that, because it certainly looks like what we would need to deal with that. We may just need to start running from outside the room. I don't like those guys. So yeah, like, what if we started from, like, all the way back here? That might be key, because there was definitely some, like, sputter at the beginning. Does it look like you're wearing it? It's like a little brooch. Okay. Alright, now, max, max fucking speed. You cannot make that. That is not doable. Okay. Let's find the other one. Wait a minute. They're, they're, um, they're on the ground. The triggers are on the ground. What if I jump? right as I was starting to hit them, so I don't start triggering them until I, like, I jump over the first couple, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. Actually, like, let's just, let's just practice a little. Take this off, come over here, and see what I'm saying. So we do that. Yeah, like that. Like, dude, we could, like, fucking vault over, like, a good chunk of the whole thing. Alright, we gotta do, do this with skill. We cannot do this. This is not doable. Alright, so that's not possible. There is another one. There was one other room that we're looking for that also has has something like that. But that one is much more likely passable. 
I don't know where it is, but like, let's go find it. Because there was definitely something good in there. I don't want to fight Squirrely Man. Ghost, Ghost Dude. I feel like it was near here, actually. Potentially. Kind of, sort of. Possibly near here. It might be near here. Anyhow. We could take a fairy, dude. Yeah, dude, I definitely remember there being, like, a fairy that was quite near. You little asshole. I will not take that shit from you. Or you. Yeah, here. This. So we gotta run, and then we gotta jump. If I go back out to here, does that reset anything that I need to be concerned with? Skeleton Man over there needs to go. This fucking skeleton dude. How much HP do you have? For real. Wow. You just cost me like fucking 50 gold or some bullshit. What is that? Alright. Woofy dude. I really don't need you give me any shenanigans here. I mean, we're gonna make it or we're gonna die, so we'll get the money back, I suppose. It's, you know, it's, it's a wash. This is a successful thing, or it's not. Sorry, we're gonna, we're gonna, you're gonna have to jump. Ugh. What did that do? What did we do? kind of assume that there would be like a point to making it across that and not just like getting stuck in the stupid little room and then having to teleport out. Oh, well, this is... Well, how do you get to the freaking sigil then, dude? Unless you gotta like drop down? But you could already get down there. Just like, how do you, how do you pop the sigil? How do you pop the sigil? I assume that you had to be over here. Did we miss the point of this room entirely? I mean, yeah, corridor wind, we have the gale thing. There's nothing like, you know, earth spear down. There's nothing to earth spear here. So I'm not going to waste one, because I don't want to waste them. I'm confused. Okay. Do we just like this thing? What is the point of this? Alright, now we're gonna I just now I just wanna know what the point of this is. Let's look at this room again, just to like understand what the fucking point of that even is. There's gotta be a reason for that. There's, that doesn't exist for nothing. It's like, yeah, okay, you can make it across that now. Fuck you. Okay. Yeah, cool. We have a fair amount of gold saved up, actually. And there's also a skeleton down here, and he is getting real real aggressive. And it's also a spooky ghost. Or, really, it's somebody masquerading as a spooky ghost. It's not actually very spooky at all. It's just a guy in a sheet. Look this dude, alright. Okay. So... What is the point, dude? What is the point? Get in there to do the to, to, to thing. I very much want to know how you get in there and pop that sigil, dude. Wait a minute. Ah, I'm retarded. Now. Now. We're on to something. Pop the fucking sigil. And. Oh, yeah, now. Okay, now there's a dais over there. Now. We gotta go waste 63 more shurikens to kill that fucking skeleton that has like 8 billion HP. Because, you know, skeleton is the most basic enemy in the game. Should definitely have 8 billion HP. He's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna fuck me. He's going to fuck me if I try and... We gotta do it. I gotta, I don't want to chance it. Like, he'll knock me back and I'll get crushed. 
so expensive. You are the most fucking expensive skeleton in the history of things with bones. Why can't it just be like the freaking dash in Super Metroid, you know? Like you have a button and you hold it down and you run and you get past a certain speed and like you do the shine spark and like it's all controllable and mechanically sound. Nah, this is some kind of nonsense here, okay. Oop. Well hey, at least the knockback there doesn't kill you. Alright, boom. I mean I should have known that was exactly what was going to happen, so. Whatever, we're good. And we get to stab into the wooden hollow on the way. And here's this, and what do we get? It's a hotel pole. Okay, I don't get the vaguest clue what the hell that is. This is snoo. What do we get? I don't think we have the need for this yet. Okay. Oh, ooh, ooh, what, ooh, ooh, ooh. A figurine that amplifies the Holy Grail's power. You can add a prayer altar to the Holy Grail's memory. What the fuck is a prayer altar? Have we seen a prayer altar? Do we know what a prayer altar is? I don't think we've been told what a prayer altar is. Also, like, what's the deal with the salt with the pepper? We don't have any salt. Maybe we need some salt, too. I don't know. But, like... What does this do? Do you, do you use it on enemies? Because I remember, like, Burger Time. You know, pepper was the only one we had. It's, it stunned enemies. Maybe it stuns enemies? Should we go and, like, apply pepper to something? Like a bat? Let's go apply pepper to a bat. I don't feel like that. But we'll check it in a little bit. Um... Yeah, I don't... Uh, I mean, that didn't get us anything, really. I mean, I'm sure it got us... something. We just loaded up a mantra. Yeah, but I don't have, I have the mantra app. Yeah, I, I don't have the freaking thing, though. I don't have the thing that, um... What do they call it? The Dejan Pillar. That's what we're looking for. We are definitely looking for the Dejan Pillar still. There's a lot of bats in this room. There are a lot of bats in this room. Skeleton too. Fuck him. Alright. So, I mean... I mean, we are cool. Hey, Earth Spears. That's good. That's good. Gotta stock, up back, stock back up on those. There may be more. There probably are more. At least in the game, anyway. Places. Not in that. Places. I mean, now we've got another mini-boss, too. Huh. Oh, you fucking dick. Fucking dick, Woofy. What the hell? And that's just uncalled for. But we already know those guys are all pricks. They look real different out here. Like, I'm pretty sure we've seen Locomolas in, like, rooms. And they talked and didn't throw grenades at us. And they didn't look like, like, like weird-ass monsters. Then. What is in here? Did we hit the switch? We hit the switch in here. Do you know the place called... Takamagahara is the land of exile for the first children, those who have lived in Eglana since time memorial. We've only ever seen one, and that's, you know, in the first game, we saw Tiamat, we saw their, their leader, and we killed her. It felt kind of weird killing a god. We killed just like two gods in that game. Anyhow, the fools are barking about fighting against those who come from the sky. I think this one of the frost giants came from the sky, or maybe it was one of the things named after a Hindu deity. I don't know, I'm confused. Even more foolishly, they have erected a fortress around their homes that none may enter. Without the means to dig below, one cannot meet with them. So we need means to dig below. Okay. Presumably we need to get the, the, the fortress of the first children somewhere. Yeah, we hit that switch. Okay. On whatever the hell this was. This is like right. This is in the beginning. This is near the area where like you fall into the mortal battlefield. This is specifically the area where you fall into the mortal battlefield. Do I want that weight? I do. We'll go back up. I don't even know why I'm going over here. But I don't know what else to do right now. I, I, I still. I still hate the rapier. It's, it's just not good. We've got many Earth Spears now. Alright, I am way less concerned about that now, which is good. Because we had two left. I was getting quite concerned about what was going to happen. 
we hit a switch and could not actually hit the switch. That would make me very sad. If we've been in this room, go down, go down there. Yep. We may or may not have been in here. Oh, it's just a thing. What is this? Race scanner? Do we have this? Do we buy this? I sold you that. You did. Wait a minute, let's look at this guy in his weird pajamas. Is this Pabla Pabalusa? Is is he just wearing like weird pajamas? Okay, those he move those things like the wings there. That looks like they're attached to him, but I still think he's wearing like weird jester pajamas. And this is where also this is where you buy Earth Spear ammo, which is good to know. We um, are very low on weights, or we're kinda low on weights, so I'll take a few. Just, you know, so we got that going on for us. So we're all, we're all set on that front. We don't want to be caught without. Really not. Like, it, it blows. I haven't experienced it in this game, but like, definitely remember it from the first game. Like, you get somewhere, you're making some progress, and then you have no weights. And you can't open a door, and like, it just sucks. It just it really fucking shits on your biscuit. Does this go back up to Anfwin? It does. Anfin? Now, we have not done this room yet either. Feather Cross Room. That's right, what did you have to do in here? It, you, need, you need something. I don't remember. That, I think that, that, we don't have it, but um, I remember us not having it. This tablet kind of said what you needed to do. Um, yeah, we're, like, we're, we're pretty much done in here, with the exception of the, um, the Ankh, the boss. Let's, um, let's go back to the surface. Let's just go back to the surface. I'm probably going to break this off here, break off an episode here, just because, like, I don't know. I, I feel a sense of completeness for what we've done. Well, I could probably do another round, so I think we're just gonna just cut it off here for uh, for, for YouTube's sake. Just the videos are well divided, so we'll save it up, and then we'll make another save at the start of the next episode. But cut it off here. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Sorry about the the delays. Uh, the only reason the videos have not been going up. On Twitch or YouTube is due to technical difficulties. I was just trying to get like the. There's no chat. I'm just checking the chat box. See if this chat is. I would be missing it. I've not been looking over there. I need to get in the habit of that. But that's why I wanted to make sure that all of my Twitch-related things are well sorted, and I need to get better acclimated with all the tools and things you gotta do. And there's still a lot. I feel like there's a lot for me to learn. Just everything about, and I gotta publicize the channel. How like uh, what what is a raid? I mean, channels are like raid each other. I don't know what that is. Uh, it's some kind of a thing. You gotta just get everything all set up. There's, there's a lot to do, but you know we took I took some steps, and now we're using I guess some more professional grade software. So I hope I have pardoned my absence. But I'm back now, and uh, if you guys are watching, if you guys are enjoying the series, click the little red subscribe button down below, and uh, drop me a like, drop me a comment. I would love to hear from you. And uh, definitely, if you have the chance, watch me live, you can uh, follow me, and you'll be notified whenever I am streaming. That'd be great. I would love to hear from you. I'd love to, to see and interact with you. I think I can link Discord through this, too, so I can have Discord for, like, interacting with people. That's probably a cool thing to do, so I'll probably be setting that up tomorrow, just to get everything all squared away. So, once again, thank you guys so very much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.